Hello, my name is Yonis Dizurli. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a simple 1D array and display the values from the array into a combo box. To do this, we need to go to File, New Project, make sure we have Visual Basic selected and Windows Form App. Name your project appropriately and then click OK. For this project, we need two objects. We need a button and we need a combo box. Increase the width of the com combo box, increase the width of the button. Okay, so when the form loads, I want the combo box to display a number of different values. So I'm going to double click on the form. So on form load, I want to create an array. So my array will be days. So uh, dim my days as a string now i'm going to create an array so i'm going to say my days zero is equals to uh, monday then i'm going to say my days one equals in double space marks Tuesday my days two equals Wednesday three equals Thursday my days four equals Friday oops my days five equals Saturday my days six equals Sunday okay I've got here all my days so I've got six values the zero value doesn't count so what I'm going to do here my days it's going to be equal six options here okay six values and here I'm going to create a for loop. So for, and say i as integer equals, oops, integer equals uh, 0, 2, 6. So it's going to keep looping this. And while it's looping, I want my combo box. So C O B combo. Combo, combo box one, which is my combo box that I've added before. I have not I've left it the default name. So combo box one dot items dot add. And then in brackets I'm gonna say my days. And then I need to specify that is repeated by the i value. 0 to 6 okay so I'm gonna press play now and if I drop down the list I've got my combo box displayed all the day so from Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday Saturday and Sunday let's close this now what I want to do I want when I double click the button let's change the text value to submit or which is this day the best click here to find out let's increase the size here okay 
So I want to find out if which one's the best day. So I'm going to say here if I'm going to create an if statement if combo box one dot text is equals to Friday, then let's put here then then message box dot show equals Friday is the best day of the week. So instead of equals, my bad, let's put open bracket there and then close the bracket here. Okay, so if that's true, then show me this message box. Else, I'm just going to copy this and I will say try again. Control C to copy, Control V to paste. I'm just going to say no, try again. So, if I press start, uh, select Monday, it will say no, try again. If I select Tuesday, no, try again. If I select Wednesday, no, try again. If I select Friday, Thursday, no, try again. If I select Saturday, no, try again. If I select Sunday, no, try again. And if I select Friday, Friday is the best day of the week. Now, this is how you create a simple 1D array and pass the values into a combo box. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next tutorial.